Hey, I heard you need simple rocket league tips. Well, you have come to the right place. I have a couple of clips and explanations that can make you a bit better. Number one, simple aerial. So in this thing, you jump up and you boost, and you're trying to maintain your car so your car doesn't flip, go flying. Now here's it in slow-mo. You jump up, boost, maintain your car, and keep holding down that boost button, whether it's B on your Xbox controller or whatever you're playing on. And now that you have done the aerial, you're just trying to, like, Keep your car maintained at all times and, like, make sure that the most important thing you can do is maintain your car. And, like, and then you just boost. Number two, aerial forwards or sideways flip. Now, on this one, you jump aerial and you side flip. Basically, you're just going to try and, like, when you aerial and hit the ball, you're going to try and hit it with more power. So, there we go. You're trying to, like, aerial. Now here it is in slow-mo. You jump, aerial, and do a flip. That was a side flip. And if it goes in or doesn't, at least you tried, but um, it's just basically easier to score a goal when you do that because you aerial... And then you flip. And then it gets a lot of power when it goes into the goal. It may take a couple of times to get used to it. But once you do get used to it, it can be a really, really helpful thing in-game. Or when there's, like, an open shot on the goal. Then when the ball's, like, levitating right in front of the goal and you know you can hit it. But basically, these two are some of the basic uh, moves that can just get you to, like, get better and... These are like kind of, I'd call them core, like core things that you need to know in order to become good at Rocket League because aerialing is what all pros do and what all pros need to do to get better and to win. So I think aerialing gets really easy, especially because they have aerial training and aerial practice. But like, it's not that easy to try and it's not that easy to get the hang of in a cup in in like in a short amount of time but once you do get the hang of aerials there it, it's so easy and it can lead you to getting a lot more wins especially if you're bronze then you can get up to like gold and um it just it will help you learn other tricks if you know how to aerial because then you can do like flip resets and other stuff like that but you have to know how to aerial before you can do any other wall shots, pinches, aerial thing. It's just really a core uh, move to know. So now we have some gameplay using some of these strategies that I taught you. And this is just a 3v3 competitive in gold, 0-0. Zero, zero. That was me, and um, I'm not the best, and um, uh, but it was 3v3s in gold um, competitive, and I just did some gameplay to use the new moves and to show you how they look in-game. But I didn't do them at all points because I wasn't really focusing on that. But I do have some points where I just hit the ball and do, and like, it's just some gameplay.